mm -hmm. product is standardized, and of course, is a must market. It's a consumer product. So that's when we said, okay, let's go with this feasibility study, and then went bank to bank, right? And said, here's my feasibility study, have a look at this. So first thing, they look at you and say, you know, I'm 21 years old, and say, uh, young lad, uh, thank you for putting this up, but what's your experience? And I said, yeah. no experience. Have you ever done this before? Never done Brilliant this. Brilliant idea, but nobody to support you. Good idea, but you've never done this before. And uh, where's your experience? So that's whole concept, which is what I relate with a lot of young startups today. They have the same problem. People asking them, what's your experience? Have you done this before? And they fail. The point then was, um, talking to others, they said, look, but you know what? East African Industries is very pro dominant on this one. And they may kill you, so Unilever may kill you there. And that stuck in the brain at the back to say, okay. So you're going against a big giant at that point in time? Yeah, we were, we were looking at because there was Kimbo and Cowboy and stuff like that being sold. So we said, okay, let's go against that in terms of processing the same products. And um, the idea was not accepted by bankers and there was no funding available for that. So how do you eventually get the capital to finance your dreams? So having got rejections again, like my insurance industry, having rejections from a lot of people saying, we can't fund it, we don't have the funds for it, and uh, going to IFC. IFC actually gave us a good idea, one of the heads there. Uh, he gave us an idea to say, start small and go one by one, go backwards from the front end, start back, and then go backward linkage. Or start from the first end of farming and then go back, go forward linkages. And Any that was help from friends and family at that point in time? So at that point, we said, okay, where do we start from? So we said, let's start from the soap side and then go backwards. It was all friends and family, right? Initially. And, yeah, initially. They supported us and said, fine, start with it. And a, a friendly banker, right, who, mm -hmm. who knew my father and, you know, um, they now run INM Bank, and uh, Biashara Bank was oh, there. Of course. And they helped us in terms of saying, okay, here's some funding. And we got that. We also That's got Suresha, IDB. right? Suresha. But we also got the IDB, who helped us initially mm -hmm. with, with the dollar funding there. And that was the initial phase of starting very small. Mm. So we started off very small, and then we wanted to go backwards all the time.